Warmind is the start of the new conversation. Yeah. It's a step forward in the direction we want to start taking yeah. Destiny. We want content that brings us back and makes us want to play more. And so we knew that like campaign was something that we needed to have nice and tight, but it was the new activities that we added to the destination that was much more important. And we wanted to add pursuits in the destination, you know, new gear sets and chasing after Seraph theme weapons and gear. So we want players to feel like they're grinding with purpose, as I call it, like yeah. focused on like, I know what I'm going for, I want to get it, and I'm going to keep playing it. It's like kind of similar to like what we just have with the DFA and the Nightfall. And we want that same feeling of like, I know that Seraph sniper rifle's behind there. Yes. I'm <laughs> keep grinding against this thing to get that gun. <laughs> Absolutely. There's going to be lore attached to all of these discoverables that are digging into that Warmind, Clovis Bray, and a Bray relationship. You explore the glaciers, you're in the Clovis Bray facility. Yeah, and the war mind is, you know, sitting up up high, but then, you know, we have uh, activities that run you through the tunnels yep. that the hive have dug out, and you come out into Hellas Basin, and then you see the skybox, you see the, the Rasputin pyramid, and, like, it's just such a, an evocative thing of, like, I want to find out. Yeah. What is there? Diversity inside of this destination is out of control. Yeah, like huge scalloped walls of ice, but then yep. like big open expanses when you're on, on the mm -hmm. top of the surface. Like, like there's a really, really cool dichotomy between all the spaces. Well, one of the things that we wanted to do was bring back the big boss fight. And so we built the destination in a way that teases and ramps up to that big fight. Destination always had in mind like the worm god and the soul. Mm -hmm. like, it started with Rasputin, and then I think the next step after that was like, who are we fighting? Formidable foe. Formidable foe, yeah. Yep. And VV definitely is like all about the big bosses. <laughs> and really wanted to bring a big boss in. And, no uh, matter how crazy you yeah, thought. Yeah, we and were. it was the, the marriage of, of, of these two <laughs> and like making them uh, coexist in a cohesive yep. manner. Another thing that came out from the playtest was uh, the new relic we're actually putting in. You get the opportunity to actually wield a weapon of Rasputin's yeah. own design. And it's this javelin we call the Valkyrie that is a really deadly long-range weapon, but yet it's super powerful if you decide to use it in melee up front. So we have all new campaigns to start out with. Uh, we've added new adventures, new quests, new exotics for players to find. And uh, we have the new uh, Escalation Protocol activity that we're adding. So we're encouraging players to stick around play a destination, explore it, uncover secrets, and learn more about uh, Rasputin and the Bray family.